Hey everybody, welcome back. This is going to be a quick tip on remote using remote desktop in a public location if you're on a Windows 7 machine. Um, they added a new switch. It's uh, MSTSC space switch public that if you're in like a public place such as a library or, or school or something and you're going to remote desktop it uh, in the home or wherever, uh, this switch will tell Windows not to save that last entry that you just put in for the server name. So that way somebody doesn't come behind you and uh, try to launch RDP and it won't have like your dynamic DNS or your IP address or whatever. So the way to do this, you just go to start, type in MSTSC space switch public and um, in this window you're not going to notice anything different from the original one but um, if we were to put like 10.2.0. Uh, I don't know, just try, I don't have a, a server here uh, on that one, let me see, 10.2.0. Let's do 11 and it's going to ask for credentials because it's not going to remember it. Um, it's not going to know what credentials you're using and uh, now of course it, go ahead and accept the certificate if you accept the certificate and I'm getting this error just because I'm trying to remote desktop into my server uh, with a non-domain account that doesn't have remote desktop rights um, I could use different credentials and get in but um, the point is if we go ahead and close this and then we go back in and just even if we just type MSTSC and we don't type the public switch um, we're not going to see that IP address in there it's not going to save it in this, this list um, so that's kind of a good thing so that way somebody doesn't get to know your dynamic DNS name and they're gonna try to start uh, hitting it all the time or, or whatever they do